Good afternoon and welcome to Equity News Highlights. My name is Rumitai Koridema. Zimbabwe Stock Exchange listed miner Rio Zim recorded a lower than expected revenue for the half year ended 30 June 2019. This has been attributed to a decrease in gold production resulting from incessant power cuts. Revenue for the period under review stood at 136.7 million Zimbabwean dollars. Following plans by the Civil Service Apex Council to protest against government's failure to meet their salary demands, government has called the council to a national joint negotiating meeting in a bid to map a way forward in solving the problems being faced by the civil servants. As the Aurora City Council is failing to provide residents with clean water, President Munangagwa yesterday pledged the government's support in procuring equipment and chemicals to improve the treatment and supply of water in Arare within the next six months. World Bank recently opened offices in Somalia where the Vice President of the World Bank, Hafez Ghanim, pledging support to the Somalians as the country awaits a decision by the World Bank and the IMF to write off their five billion debt. De Beers, the world's biggest diamond producer, lowered prices by 5% at its November sale. The move is aimed at helping improving profits for the middlemen in the diamond industry. These have been getting low profit margins due to low prices and an oversupply of polished gems. Thank you for watching. Good afternoon.